let's look at this question, right? Recurring decimal 0 0.023, recurring as a fraction in simplified form. Any recurring number can be written as a fraction, okay? So, in other words, the recurring numbers are rational numbers. So, if you know rational numbers, rational numbers are numbers which can be written as a fraction with a numerator and a denominator. So, my, I've done a video where I have used algebra to write a recurring decimal as a fraction. Now, in this video, I want to use geometric sequence to write this as a simple, as a fraction. Okay, so I've done the questions. So I'll go over the steps slowly. So, first step is 0 0.023 recurring. You should understand this. 0 0.023. This number, 23 is repeating. Okay, that's what it means. 2, 3 keeps on repeating. It goes up to infinity. Okay. So, now to write this as a sum, or this is called a partial sum. So, 0 0.023 recurring is same as 0 0.023 plus 0 0.0023 uh, plus so on. So, let me show this on a calculator. So, this is I used... I'm now using a scientific calculator. I had a student asking me to write, use the scientific calculator. So what I'm explaining is this plus this plus this will give you a number which is which makes two three recurring. So let me show you that zero point two. Sorry, it is point zero two three zero point zero two three plus. Let me add this. That is point three zero three zeros one two three two three plus now you have to put one two three four five zeros point one two three four five two three okay can you see this number two three and two three is repeated so if you keep on so here I have got I put three zeros and two three then I put three plus two five zeros so the next number will be uh, seven zeros and then two three will give you if you keep on adding them up to infinity you will get this number okay now this if you take these numbers if you take say these numbers individually if you take these numbers they are forming a geometric sequence okay so if it is uh, 0 0.023 uh, this is the next number this is the next number is a geometric sequence. So if you look at these numbers closely, you'll find that these numbers are becoming smaller and smaller and smaller. Okay. Okay, now geometric sequence is a sequence where each number, the subsequent number becomes either smaller or greater. In this, this is reducing. So yeah, to find a geometric, how do you decide a geometric sequence? By looking at a ratio. If you take the ratio of this and this, if it's a common ratio, then it's a geometric sequence. Let me show you that. So if you go this divide by this, so let me cancel this. 0 0.030, so 1, 2, 3, 2, 3, divided by 0 0.023. What's the ratio? Ratio is 0 0.1, 0 0.01. So this is becoming 1 hundredth of this. So this next number is one hundredth of this. So let me show you that. So point, how many zeros? One, two, three, four, five zeros. One, two, three, four, five, two, three, divided by three zeros. Point, one, two, three, two, three. So this is becoming one hundredth smaller. Okay. Or uh, this times point oh one. So I hope you can understand. So this number if you multiply by 0 0.01 times 0 0.01 will give you this number and if you multiply this number by 0 0.01 or 01 you'll get this number so this number is getting smaller and smaller and this number is going to approach zero okay so here your starting number is 0 0.023 and the common ratio r stands for the ratio which is 0 0.01 Okay, now as you can understand logically, if you keep on adding these numbers, it'll be approaching one number. Okay, so so you can find S infinity. Okay, so S infinity has got this formula. S infinity is A divided by 1 over 
uh, a divided by 1 minus r gives you s infinity. What does that mean? If you add, if you add these infinite numbers, it will be approaching one particular number. That's what we are telling. Okay, so in this case, it will be 0 0.023 divided by 1 minus 0 0.01. So this is 0 0.023, 1 minus 0 0.01 is 0 0.99. You can check that on your calculator yourself. So your final answer is, uh, so let's do this on the calculator. Uh, this will be, so let's use calculator. Where's my cancel? So 0 0.023 divided by 0.99. Can you see this number is repeating itself? Okay, or if you simplify that, that's 23 over 23 divided by 990 will also give you this number. So can you see this number is repeated? 0.23 is recurring. 